Welcome to the Internet Empowerment Series of Video Tutorials. I'm Deltina Hay, author of the Social Media Survival Guide and the Bootstrapper's Guide to the Mobile Web, and professor of Drury University's Social Media Certificate Program. In this session, I'm going to show you how to create a YouTube gallery using a playlist. First, make certain that you're logged into YouTube, and then go to your Video Manager. Now you can create playlists from either the videos that you upload or even from videos that you've favorited. So you can make video galleries even if you go through and favorite videos on YouTube, maybe on a particular topic or something, and you can place those as a collection or a playlist as a gallery on your website. So first of all, here are all of the videos that I have in my channel. What I want to do is add them to a playlist and then put that playlist as a gallery on my website. So I'm going to select the videos that I want to add to the playlist. And once I've selected all the videos that I want in the playlist, I want to pull down Add To, and then go down to Add New Playlist. If you already have a playlist created, that's fine, but I'm going to go ahead and click on Add to New Playlist. At this point, I just give the playlist a name, and then just click on Create Playlist. So now if I go over here to Playlists, I see that I have a new playlist with the videos that I selected within it. Now, if I click on Edit the Playlist, and I click on this Share button right here, then what I see are some ways for me to share the playlist or even embed it onto a website. So if I click Embed, then now I have some code that I can copy and place on my website. Now I want to have a little bit of control over the size of this gallery. So I'm going to come down here and give it a custom width. And you notice that it adjusts the height accordingly. And it also adjusted the width and height here in the code that I'm going to copy. So once I have the gallery the way I want it, I'm going to copy that code and then place it on my website. Now I want to embed the video gallery code into my website. So I have the page that I want the gallery to be on. And I have the cursor here in Dreamweaver where I want it to show up. So I'm going to go ahead and paste the code. And then as we can see, we now have the gallery embedded in the website. Now you, the users, when they access your website, can advance to the next video on the slide using this button or start playing the, you know, all the videos right in a row using this button. Or, you know, they have an you know, they can look at the entire playlist by just popping it open like he, right here. Or they have any number of other ways that they can control the gallery. So this is a nice, easy, quick way for you to create a very functional video gallery right on your website just by copying your playlist code. One thing I do want to mention is I do talk a lot about WordPress in my videos. So I want to make certain that you know that when you add code like this to a WordPress website, then you need to make certain that you add it to the HTML view and not the visual view of the WordPress site. And that concludes this session. Thank you for listening today. Check out the bootstrappersguide.com for many free resources, worksheets, and examples for creating your own presence in the mobile web. Or get the book Anywhere Books Are Sold, The Bootstrapper's Guide to the Mobile Web, Practical Plans to Get Your Business Mobile in Just a Few Days for Just a Few Bucks. And check out my previous book, The Social Media Survival Guide, already in its second edition and used by colleges, universities, and libraries around the world.